Hey everyone, Eamon here, back with, um, I guess a, a long anticipated, uh, AFL reaction. Um, apologies, it's been a while since we, since we've watched some AFL or some Aussie rules. Um, yeah, we did a few reactions over, over the summer. I had hoped to, like, get up to speed with, like, the rules and, like, the league itself, um, by the time finals rolled around, but I kind of just, like, got off track with my YouTube stuff and didn't really get around to it but um yeah i figured i've had a lot of people asking if, if i'll react to the to the finals and stuff so we'll do the grand finals here and then i guess throughout the off season we'll kind of slowly build our knowledge base of uh of aussie rules up and then hopefully go into uh to next season like full swing like following along maybe during a stream every, every once in a while as well to watch the watch party stuff like it with my nrl content if you if you're subscribed um but yeah let's just hop into it uh sub if you're not sub like the video comment your thoughts let me know uh players uh specific highlight reaction etc for afl that you want me to check out i'll add them to the list we can do that over the uh, the next few months as uh i guess the next season starts probably i'd wager like march april maybe 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 a bit later i don't know but yeah let's hop into it all right so yeah, Sydney Swans, Brisbane Lions, um, those are two pretty major cities in Australia. So I'd wager these teams are probably pretty popular, the two of them. Um, yeah, I don't know too much about the teams. Like, like I said, I haven't really watched too much AFL, but we'll see if I can follow along with the rules. I remember some of the stuff. I probably don't remember the... the um, I definitely don't remember like the how many points each thing's worth, each type of score is worth. But like, I remember like there's like marks and stuff and that sort of thing. Um, but yeah, let's hop into it. And then we'll, we'll after the video we'll take a look at like uh, each team's history on Wikipedia or something just to get some background info. All right, Swans Lions Grand Finals highlights. Let's go. Neil to Barry, Barry are up one of McCluggage. Nice. The turnover complete. Heaney on the rebound. Oh, huge tackle! They got him. They got him all right. <laughs> they got him. <laughs> Errol Golden to Amadi. Oh. Oh, was that like pass interference? Okay. Just flows through the middle. Kick it, drop out. Yeah, it's crazy. Oh, yeah, the passings with the. Yeah, you like punch the ball. It's crazy. All right. Yeah, it's looking like a blowout early. Is it 13 to 2? Yeah, 13 to 2. Look at that. Lester ran on to it, and that's how easy it can be. Yeah. When you take the short way home, RG is going to play on and go to Lohman. Wow, they were determined. In he comes. That's that nice. is absolutely perfect. All right. Okay, closer game. Yeah, yeah. the scoreboard, it's said, like right. the first number there is the, the goals, right? Inside I think. I forget what the second number is, though. Is that the, 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 out, the outside post, maybe? Yeah. Oh, what a kick. Wow. That was sick. Yeah, I remember, I love the kicking plays in Aussie Rules. Um, that's one of my favorite things about Rugby League is the kick plays, so it made sense that I would like it in Aussie Rules. Oh, no way. What just happened? Crazy. Yeah, what just happened? There? Interesting, okay. Cluggage to Rayner. Quick release here for Berry. They're out everywhere here. There's the mark. So nice. Another one of those build ups where they're happy to be patient. He can score from there, right? Around the body, Charlie Cameron. That's why. Look at yeah. that. Nice. It's hard to see the uh the second quarter. It's hard to see the ball with the because the crowd's like the same color. To Bailey he didn't want to run away. Bailey able to get Rampy under the footy. He's got foot speed. He's got space. He's got Lohman. Lohman from 30 and closing. Okay, Lohman he seems goes. to be Lohman doing a ton in this game. In yeah, he looks like he's popping off. Is he usually this good or is he just having like an, like an all-timer all game? Lohman doing everything. No way. What a catch. Okay, this guy, if, there, if there's a grand finals MVP, it's going to him. That's crazy. The cluggage. McCluggage is a crazy name. Oh, what a play. Yeah. And that's exactly what he does. Right down the pipe. Alright, Brisbane's pulling away, it looks like. Yeah, what's I forget the scoring. What's the second number? Is the second number here the um Are those scores in like the, the side uh the side uh 
man, what are they called? The side leg posts or whatever. It's like you get less points for those. Is that what that is? I feel like that doesn't add up properly though. Because yeah, that, the score would be closer, right? I think. I don't know. Let me know. Let me know. I, I totally forget. Work right from Barry. But yeah, let's see. So, yeah, Brisbane's definitely pulling away. I guess this is almost the end of the game here. Yeah, there's another one. I love the Brisbane uh, uh, uniforms. Cameron's got the, flat the blue with the maroon and gold. The yellow. Gold gets back on that lift. No now way. No back. way. What is that angle? What is that angle? I need, I, I need to see a replay. Is there a replay? I need to see a replay. Of that. Look at this. He, he kicked a left foot too, right? I think his left foot. Yeah, left foot. for That's crazy. Actually, I guess left foot would probably be easier from that angle than right foot. But still, that's crazy. The angles, the angles of the kicks are insane. Holy crap. That's wild. Okay, yeah, they're up by a lot. Absolutely. Logan Morris. Oh man. Neil. Dude, the field, it's so when the camera's more zoomed out, it's so crazy seeing how big the field is. Look at Morris. It's absolutely massive. To make it six in a row for the Lions. Jeez. Yeah, absolutely. Just smoking them. Oh, okay, there is more. Okay. I thought for some reason I thought there was is it four quarters then? Ball's gotta sit for Big Joe, it does. I was I thought it was two halves for for some reason. Oh what a kick. A pass. That's coming back. Oh wow. He curved it. Lockie Neal with possession number twenty two in a grand final. Tries to caress it around the corner. Roberts to Blakey. Blakey on the run and he finally finds an unmanned. Nice, yes, there you go. Probably not enough time for a comeback, I'd wager, but let's see. There's one. Sydney. Just a little seed. <laughs> and away they go. Is that happening here now? Off hands, maybe oh, not. No way. Okay, that was a side side post, I believe. Or maybe not, maybe not. Danaher from a long Jeez. way out. Oh, what a kick. That was crazy. Oh, yeah. High flying guy. I forget what that's called when you. There's a turn for it when you jump on top of someone. I forget what the third is called. Jeez. Up there by 60 in the grand finals. That's, is this one of the biggest blowouts in grand finals history? I'm not sure what the score usually is. I feel like I definitely have seen high scores before, but. That's crazy. Fourth quarter. Fox. Now Parker. I can definitely understand why you guys, uh, you guys were saying this. The sport's a lot better to watch in person because yes, there's just so much space in the field. It's hard to like. It's hard to watch on TV. Like it's definitely like. <laughs> this must be how people feel watching hockey for the first time. When like the ball's tiny here and the, the puck in hockey's tiny. On, on TV, <laughs> it's so zoomed out. Has been right. really good. Can have no a way, Loman! Wow, dude, hey, K hey, Loman, Loman's my favorite player. <laughs> Loman's my favorite player in the short of AFL I've seen. That's crazy. What a game! What a game! Cam Rayner, Ashcroft, all the big names. Jeez. Jeez. That's crazy. The stadium, too, is insane. It's 100k, right? Which is 100k stadium. Yeah. Congrats, Brisbane. Again, it stays in. And the Lions are lightning in a bottle. Crazy. 120 to 60. That's wild. <laughs> Is that their at their team song? The Brisbane song. Like like
Jeez, there you go. Alright, let's take a look at the comments after. Um, okay, we'll give that a like first of all. If my thing will work properly. Smokes, there we go. Uh, Hip would have the presence of mind to immediately do the Acker celebration is cold as fuck. Okay, you guys gotta let me know what this means. Assuming it's uh, a guy on the on the swans, maybe he likes to taunt again. Sixty point margin is so generous to the swans. Four late junk time goals, a fifty meter gift from the ums in Brisbane, and accuracy. The score should have been more like one hundred and fifty thirty five based on how they played. Okay, so this was even close then. I mean, it already wasn't close, but it was even worse than it was. Ban the swans from playing in grand finals. The real grand final was Brisbane versus Geelong. Ge 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 I'm not sure how to say that, that city. Um, it's not even surprising to see Sydney get smashed in a grand final anymore. Okay. Katy Perry put on a better show this one. Oh, yeah, I, I did see Katy Perry was the musical guest, which is, um, I mean, there's a bit of controversy with her lately, but I guess that that is a pretty big get uh, as like a musical uh, headline. Let me know how the show was. Hopefully she played some of her, her, her old bangers from back in the day. Um, yeah. Yeah, everyone talking about how bad the swans were. Why is no one talking about the dominance of the lions? Yeah. Yeah, that's always like a... What's it called? A uh, People always say a team played really bad, but they kind of discount that maybe a team just played so good the other team looked even worse. But I guess, I guess you can tell. You can tell if a team, like, if they're just like missing easy passes and stuff, then obviously that that, that they're not playing well. Anyways, okay, let's take a look at uh, Brisbane Lions. We'll take a look at their history, see how, how many titles they've won and stuff. Um, I assume they're probably a pretty storied franchise because like Brisbane's a big city, I know. So actually, okay, they were an expansion club because okay, so they weren't originally there. They were the Brisbane Bears originally. They evolved into the into the Lions. They were a foundation team in the AFL women's competition. They featured in five grand finals at the time, winning two titles. Okay. Okay, we'll skip through this. Triple Premiership success. So they won three grand finals in a row, it looks like, back in the day. And then they lost in the finals. Uh, it looks like they rebuilded for like years. Back to back grand final. Okay, so so they yeah they kind of went through a lull it looks like just based off this and then they kind of they're back to back now let's see though um, okay eighth sixteenth third sixth second second third second oh no okay they, they won they won they won three in a row and then were grand finalists so they lost their fourth one in a row that's kind of crazy and then Jesus look, look, what like yeah what happened here. They got like they're like one of the worst teams for like over a decade. Okay, let me. I'm actually going to read about this. 2005. Let's see this. All right, it just seems like I guess they just didn't. They were just bad for a while. I guess I assume like incompetence from management and stuff. That's usually the case. But anyways, okay. So let's like, keep going. They got wooden spoon. That was like yeah, that's brutal. Wooden. Spoon. Look look at their crowd attendance too. Thirty three thousand, and then it just went down and down and down to to sixteen thousand. That's crazy. Anyway, so then they, they got back into it. They got uh, second in the in the premiere and then semifinals and second again in uh, preliminary finals. They got fourth to do sixth. And then they got then they lost in the finals last year and then they won this year. So that's crazy. That must have been awesome to see, I guess. I mean chosen three isn't that long to go without winning, but like I I'm I'm a Leafs fan, as you can see up uh, up here and we haven't won since 1967, which is, uh, that's a long time. <laughs> it's a long time. So I don't feel as bad for teams that are, haven't won in like 20 years, but yeah, going 20 years without a title is pretty crazy. I guess if you, if you had won three in a row, so congrats to you guys. That's pretty awesome. Um, and yeah, oh, spawn, they got, oh the new balance sponsor. Let's go. I just recently bought some new balance shoes. <laughs> All right. Okay. I guess, should I look at the swan? Let's look at the swans too. You guys, I mean, there's probably not many Swans fans watching this reaction, but if you, if you are, we'll show you some love. Maybe hype your guys' team up a bit. Let's see. Uh, New South Wales. Yeah, they've been around for a while. Um, geez, okay, their thing is super long. Their beat is way longer than the other one. Okay, where are the stats at? Holy crap. These okay, guys, the Swans must be one of the biggest teams then if their page is this long. Okay. Members, finishing position. And then premiers is the okay premiers is in gold, so they got final. They made finals like a lot. Lost in the finals here. They won two thousand five, then lost 
one twenty twelve, and they got second, second, second. All right, that's pretty crazy. The members, oh well, yeah, members are. That's a cool thing that uh, you guys have in Australia. The membership thing they have that in NRL as well, right? Where you you like pay to like become a like a club member, and that sort of like helps fund the team. That's a pretty cool concept. Um, yeah, so that's pretty. Is their average? They average thirty eight k this year. That's crazy. I guess their stadium is probably one of the big ones, but that's still insane. Um, yeah, so yeah, that, they're, they're looking like a pretty storied team as well. I guess they've only won twice, but they're generally one of the better teams. Yeah. Anyways, okay, we'll wrap it up there. Yeah, so that was my 2024 AFL Grand Finals reaction. Um, not the best game, I guess. Uh, it was, yeah, not not a very close one, so that's unfortunate. But yeah, congrats, Brisbane fans. Um, it looked like it was exciting. Like, it definitely looks like an exciting sport. So I'm really excited to check it out more and then, like, watch some games live uh, next season. We'll, we'll try We'll try to, yeah. If you're, if you're already subs subscribed, you've seen, like, my NRL content. And I try to, like, try to do a stream once a week and then react to all the games as well, all the highlights. Um, so that would probably be the plan for next season. Um, but obviously, if, if I don't actually end up liking the sport, then I'm not going to keep watching it. So we'll see how that goes. But like, yeah, like I I, I'm, I try to be as honest as I can in my reaction. So if, if I'm not enjoying something, I'm not going to just keep doing it for the sake of it. But from what I've seen so far, it's pretty it's pretty awesome. But we'll, we'll have to see. We'll have to see if it uh, if it make, if it makes sense like long term and stuff. But yeah. So yeah, make sure to drop a sub, drop a like, comment your thoughts. Let me know what to check out next. Um, yeah, we'll probably try to do. I mean, I've said this every time I've done an AFL video, but I'll try to do like one 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 a week maybe one every two weeks if if i'm if i'm not grinding youtube as hard as i as i uh as i hope to but um yeah we'll, we'll keep we'll keep it up because i know there's a lot of you guys that like afl that also like nrl so that's always good um could have some crossover between my subscribers and stuff so yeah we'll keep it going um yeah i'll wrap it up there thanks for watching um yeah see you guys